Well, this guy the other day came into the gas station I was at. I was in there trying to get me some Krispy Kremes, but they still won't let me have any unless I uh, have a background check to prove that I work for the police peoples. This guy went, came in while I was there arguing with the guy. I was like, give me my donuts. And he said, no, you can't have no donuts. And while we were arguing, the guy ran, and this guy came in. He went right back to the bathroom. And, and we're in there arguing. I'm give me my donuts now. I don't need no background check. He said, yes, you do. You have to prove you are a policeman to have any donuts. You know that. We do this every day. I said, no, give me my donut now. And then just then, just then, the guy came running out of the bathroom. And as he was running out of the bathroom, he came up and he was going to run out the door. And he ran past me and he went, pow, and he knocked into me. And he fell down to the ground. And I picked him up and I said, what the hell is your problem there? And he said, I just set the toilet on fire. And I said, what? Why did you set the toilet on fire? And, and he ripped open his coat. And when he ripped open his coat, he had cans of ready whip, whipped cream taped all over his body. I said, what the hell's wrong with you, boy? And he took one of them whipped cream cans and he put the lid off and he went pow and he shoved it up his nose. And he started spraying it all up into his nose. And what the hell? And the boy started shaking and he was going crazy. And they fell to the ground. And he fell to the ground and you can see the whipped cream coming out the other side of his nose. And he was shaking and he was shaking and he was just laying on the ground shaking and shaking. I kicked the whipped cream out of his nose. The can away from him. And he was and he just laid there with his mouth open. You can see the whipped cream was all the way in his mouth and it fell in his mouth. It was a really creepy, scary thing to see. And then, and then it was like, oh man. And while I was doing all that with that guy, the guy behind the counter called the cops. And the cops came and they said, whoa, what's going on here? And he said, this guy set fire to the toilet. And then he started putting whipped cream up his nose. And the police picked him up. And they dragged him outside. And, and we went and let him put the toilet and fire out. And then we came out and that guy was gone. We said, what happened to that guy? And he said, well, we let him go. I said, why would you let that guy go? He let the thing on fire. He shot with cream up his nose. He's crazy. He said, no, he's not crazy. We asked him. He said, well, what did he say he did? He said, he set the toilet on fire because God told he wanted all the shit in the world burn up. And so he's doing what God said to do. And he said, besides, nobody was hurt. No real harm was done. And the donuts are all safe. I said, well, the donuts are safe because I kept them away from the donuts, that crazy man. And they said the donuts weren't hurt, so we let them go. I said, well, since I saved your donuts, can I have my donuts now? And they said, no! Now get out of here before we arrest you for trying to take what you can't have, boy! And so I had to go home without my donuts. And I don't think I'll ever have a can of whipped cream ever again. It was a pretty scary day, let me tell you what.